Right. Okay, Dubai. Federal Reserve Bank, Bank of England, European Central Bank, they all report to Bank of International Settlements that's right. in, in Switzerland. And that's another black box. And that's another highly corrupt institution. And uh, again, the thriving in the darkness of non-accountability and non-transparency. Now, the only solution going forward, if we're talking solutions now, if we're going to yes. walk away from prosecuting the financial terrorists Paulson, Geithner, and Bernanke, which I don't know why we have to do that, but if we're going to walk away from that responsibility as citizens, mm. uh, the way forward would be to a uh, Brenton Woods 3, which has as its basis some relation to gold. Uh, gold is obviously uh, the only way you're going to create a sound global economy in terms of returning some integrity to a currency. And some countries like China, for example, are aggressively buying gold right Absolutely. now because they realize that eventually when the system and this next wave crashes down, and it's going to have another massive banking crash in the next six to nine months. I can, I'll bet you uh, lunch at uh, Maxine's <laughs> that there's another huge banking crisis in the next six months. And when this finally does crash, uh, the only thing left standing will be gold bullion, and China recognizes this, and this is why they're aggressively buying in anticipation of this uh, moment. Where I agree with Max is that the world needs a reserve currency that's credible. The yeah. dollar cannot be a reserve currency anymore because it's backed by two deficits that are so huge that are putting it to risk. No, the, These, the Russians and Chinese are saying that as absolutely. well. Absolutely. Yeah. But gold today, is it's too late to put it there. We need to have a new uh, 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 special drawing rights mm. uh, set by a super IMF, which would be international with governance that will allow Europe to have a very, very high hand there. The emergence, uh, emerging countries will have a high hand there and will determine the special drawing rights. That means a basket of currencies that will be credible with the dollar with the euro, with the renminbi, with the yen, and with the main commodities, gold and oil. Gold and oil have to be there. It's and, not too late for uh, gold. And we should be too, heading it's not too late for gold. That's like saying it's too late for honesty. It's too late for integrity. Without it's too late integrity, for civilization. You know, listen, you, okay, the, it's not too, a special drawing rights and a beefed right. up IMF. It's the just, you're just putting the same guys in charge of right. more of fiat currencies, financial engineering, Absolutely. high frequency trading, fraud and deception, not transparency, not accountability, well, financial well, so, terrorist going, crimes. Going back to Goldman Sachs, those bonuses, I mean, it does rather suggest that the people running Goldman Sachs are grossly out of tune with the national No, movement. come on. The, the bonuses uh, idea and the uh, paradis fiscaux, the uh, fiscal uh, have, have, have Haven's idea is just a way to tell the people don't worry about the main issues we'll treat these uh, re uh, relatively small issues the real issue is that is the financial world linked to the real economic world if it's not linked to it through derivatives and through virtual instruments that are, not, are misused because they are needed but they are misused then we do have problems don't forget that Goldman Sachs made about 3.5 billion profits. So the shareholders are benefiting from this. They were given 3.5 the, billion from but, taxpayers but in America. Made, call it a profit. They, 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 they didn't them. make them. They of stole them. I think, if, you, if I go to a bank and I steal a thousand dollars, you're going to say, oh, I made a thousand dollars? That's absurd. The shareholder <laughs> made money. The shareholders are complicit. You know, if Goldman Sachs took Auschwitz public, they would sell shares to their friends and family and say, this concentration camp's a great business. Would you support Auschwitz concentration camp oh because God, Goldman no. Sachs took it public? You know, the, the tragedy of 9-11 is that more of these Goldman Sachs bankers didn't go down. That's the ultimate tragedy. Goldman, here's more. Here's the last of my money, Goldman. Take it. Here's the last money I have, you crooks. Take the last money I have. You're, you're crooks. It's well, disgusting. Well, uh, it's good to be emotional because, uh, as we say, f feels the, uh, uh, the the fire, the one who steps on it. But let's say the way out is not only to say this is the ill part, but yeah. the solution is to build a new system that is global with world governance that takes into account integrity. Integrity and governance is needed not only in countries that are uh, behind, but it's needed in so-called advanced countries too. And the, uh, the the investor has to be confident in that. Why are interest rates so high while the official interest rates so low? If you go borrow money today, anywhere, mm. you to buy a car, it's going to be very expensive. Okay, Max, I can't give you the last oh, one. Come, on, come to the end of the it's program. July 14th. All France, we have time for is I say. Please join us again tomorrow for another edition of Face Off here on France Bank Cap. Goodbye for now. <laughs> Thanks very much. <laughs>